Hello everyone, Red Red Fern here once again. How are you all? Hope you're doing well. Today we are looking at another one of the on passive products, and today we've been looking at O Mail. So, how do you access all the information about O Mail if you want to have a look or show it to somebody else? Simply go over to onpassive.com and up will come the on passive official uh, website. Go to products at the top here. Okay, and then you can scroll looking at all of the products. As you can see over here is Omail. If you click on explore more, it will pop up in a different window. So let's have a little look at it then. Uh, Omail is an organizational communication in a hassle free manner. Switch to an easy and effortless way to communicate at your workplace. On Passive has really designed a fantastic uh, mail uh, platform here for the user. And as you can see already, uh, there is some great features. It gives you an oversight here of what is available. And also just underneath it is uh, more information about Omail, which we're going to run through here. For those of you who are new to On Passive, you will notice that every single one of our products has a O before it this is to give our branding a well recognized uh, note out there in the online space so that everything it to do with on passive has the o at the beginning with it uh, i did o connect yesterday and today we are doing o mail so o mail is a web email platform created by on passive the platform may enables the user to exchange communications and gives them a unique experience of communicating effortlessly. Omail has various features that make it the best email platform and prove to be a significant competitor in the global market. We really do believe that Omail is going to be used by hundreds of thousands, if not millions of participants because of how easy it is to use and the features that have been enabled for us to use this product. AI technology, that is artificial intelligence technology, in the domain-based Omail has intelligent features like uh, unlimited storage, for instance, on and offline integration of calendars. This means that you can very easily schedule stuff. You can online and offline. Uh, if you have mobile devices that already have calendars on them, it syncs in very easily with all of these. Synchronization of email uh, across multiple devices, like I've just said, very, very easy to do. It is plug and play, click and drag and drop facilities all over it. Uh, you can import as well contacts and addresses from existing email addresses very easily, to name a few, from the plethora. Uh, sorry, from the platter of various features that are offered by the email platform. Moreover, Omail users are given many options to create an email, customize it in various ways uh, according to their preferences and enable notifications across multiple devices. Once again, scheduling emails, what time they've got to go out, etc, etc. So it really is a user-friendly email platform. Omail strives to provide the best experience to its users worldwide by enabling them with the latest updates in the email platform, creating exciting and long-term relationships with the user. So not only are we going to provide a fantastic email platform, we're also going to update it. Not only are you going to see updates with the email platform, but we're actually going to tell you what these updates are. Uh, we'll tell you via email into your inbox uh, different features, how to use them, uh, a bit of a uh, show through, etc. Uh, have you tried doing this, etc. To give you a much better experience of not only uh, writing emails, but also how to send them out in a fantastic way. So let's have a look at the key features of Omail. Omail is an artificial intelligent powered email service comes with multiple features that enhance the and uh, the ease with which you send and receive emails and manage your contacts it is convenient and a user-friendly solution to all of your email needing all emailing needs sorry 
So you get unlimited storage spaces. Now, how many times have you been told, for instance, by some of the email providers, sorry, you need to upgrade or pay for more storage? I know I certainly have, and many of you out there will know that with OnPassive, like I said yesterday with OConnect, every single one of our products has unlimited capacity for that one uh, fantastic price. Access online and on offline calendars. This means that uh, if you have your own device uh, and it's offline, all that information can be scheduled, put into your calendar automatically, and then you forget, forget about it. Whether you use an online calendar or an offline calendar, this can be synced into your emails. Sync emails across multiple devices. <clears throat> that means that you can sync all of these together and each one will pick it up uh, very, very easily. Uh, it again, uh, it's extremely easy to set up. Import contacts from uh, old email providers to your OML account effortlessly. All you have to do is import it and it will uh, migrate it across straight away. Customize and enable notifications. How good is that? Uh, you will be able to customize the uh, ringtones, the bell tones, etc. when you receive uh, emails as well for whatever you want. So let's have a look at some of the FAQs uh, that we have for OMEL. What does CC and BCC mean, for instance? CC is a carbon co pot copy. This means that when you send out an email, if you have CC'd somebody into it via the line of CC, that every user will see that email. Okay, if you want to add somebody into an email, but you don't want the other users to see that email, then you use BCC. This is a blind carbon copy. They are part of the email, but other users cannot see their email as, to, uh, uh, as well. The next one is, uh, is email secure? A very good question. Something that we all look at on a daily basis is our online security. The security level of your email would depend on the email service provider used by you. Some providers like ProtonMail use an end-to-end -end encryption, which means only you and the recipient can read the contents of uh, an email. With Omail, it is going through our own servers. This means that we do have control over that security and that there is uh, a lot of um, firewalls that we use. So it is a very, very secure email. What should I do uh, if my email is hacked? Change the password is always the first thing you should do. It shouldn't be something that is easy to be guessed. We recommend that you have a 10 digit um, password that includes capitals, lowercase numbers and symbols. This should be changed on a regular basis. We recommend that it should be changed every three months. But obviously this is entirely up to you. This is how to be really, really secure online. Uh, you should have a separate and authentic password uh, for every different account. Do not use the same password for all of them. What's the difference between an IMAP and a POP3? Good question. POP3 and IMAP both are incoming email protocols. In POP3, an email gets downloaded from a mail server to a device and the same mail is deleted from the server here, there is only one copy of the mail available on a device. So what happens now is because we are going through our own servers, that information will be available on our own servers. Are email addresses case sensitive? Email addresses are not case sensitive irrespective of how you type the mail gets delivered to the receiver. Basically, what does that mean? Whether you type it in capitals or lowercase, it still gets recognized. So Omail is going to be a really good, versatile product uh, for the user. This is just an overview. Uh, obviously, if you want to know more, uh, as soon as it gets released to the public, you will have the opportunity to use it uh, for free to start with. And then if you like what you see, then you will be able to uh, use it fully with the full version. That's it from me. 
be coming back to you very shortly with another product overview of on passive my name is red redfern if you've liked what i have done here please subscribe to this channel and most importantly click that notification bell and you will be updated on any more videos that i upload that's it for me bye for now